Hi guys, Creative Lori here. Welcome everyone. <laughs> Welcome. If you're new to my channel, I am a home stager and I like to share with you all my DIYs, decor hauls, projects, and such. But today I have a Dollar Tree haul. And if I sound kind of monotone today, it's because I'm really, really tired. Um, it's been a really long day and um, I'm exhausted, but I had to share with you this haul that I got the other day and I just haven't had time. I've just been working, um, trying to catch up on work again and my dad has been doing well, um, leaving him for, you know, certain amounts of time. So, um, thank you everyone again for all of your nice comments. I just can't believe it. But um, today I wanted to go over the Dollar Tree haul. I got some basic things. It's not a huge haul. I did get some um, Jot white glue and you get two of them in the package. And I think that's a really good deal. I don't think they're very much anyways, like Elmer's glue, but I have a project coming up the 4th of July that I'm gonna be doing with this. Um, I'm not sure if I'm going to show it, but I have another project I might be able to use this for, too, that I will show you guys. Um, okay, so I went to the Dollar Tree two different times because I needed something while I was staging. I needed one thing, and I needed, like, a bag of rocks. And the Dollar Tree that I went to didn't have them. I just needed one bag, and I was obsessed about it because where I had put them in a bowl, it wasn't enough and I didn't have any more. So when I went to the $1 tree, I ended up getting these, oops, these beautiful sunflowers that are perfect for the fall. And you guys know I'm crazy now about, yes, I said crazy, about the, um, oh, there's a bit of a glare I see right there. Um, about sunflowers and these I feel are like perfect for um, fall you know kind of pumpkin colored and everything they're pretty but then <laughs> I went back the day out or the next one excuse me and they had um, some other sunflowers I guess smaller in scale but much prettier I thought in my opinion uh oh um and then these pictures let me show you these pictures so you guys saw me haul these two you saw me i have the canvas pig oh gosh there's like a glare but um so i found the actual picture i don't know weeks ago probably and then i had found the rooster that kind of matched and i put it in my laundry room okay well, now I finally found the cow. It's Bessie. Oh my goodness. I didn't even, I think I vaguely remember someone hauling this and then I forgot about her. And so when I found it, it was like the last one too. I am in love. I love that big fat nose. Oh my gosh, she's so sweet. And then together with the pig, the colors are like perfect. And then the rooster, perfect. So, so happy to get these. I couldn't believe it. They did have more pictures. Honestly, I was looking for something totally different just while I was kind of scanning through the department. And they didn't have what I was looking for. Um, so I found, I was kind of thumbing through these. And then I found the, the cow, and um, which you can't see now. Shoot, and she's the star of the show. <laughs> and then I found this one, Premium Quality Farm to Table. Now, I have different versions of Farm Fresh or Farm to Table, and one has the pig, it says uh, Barbecue Emporium, one has that cow, one has a rooster, and so now I feel like I have the whole set, and then this one is in like a newspaper background, I don't know if you can see that, and I just love it, so... I'll probably um, spray paint the frame on this one black. I did do a project with some of my pictures and I'll show you in a second. I'm not sure I like it though. But for this one, I think for this piggy, I might do the frame in black, same with the cow and then the rooster. Keep them all black because I think that looks nice. And then I have black appliances in my um, kitchen. Okay, 
Let's talk about the sunflowers real quick. So, I like these sunflowers better. And I have been saying I've been wanting some white sunflowers. These are kind of like a vanilla colored, aged looking, and they have that burlap material. Kind of like the ones I had bought a while ago um, at Hobby Lobby. Sorry, I have paint on my hands. So they have burlap on the inside, and they are smaller um, sunflower, but look how beautiful they are. And they had all these different colors, you guys. I was freaking out. So I got all that they had in the cream, and there was only six of them. And I just think they're beautiful with that burlap in there. That's more my style and color. I like the neutrals. So I sort of feel like those orange ones I should take back because they had these sunflowers in a rust orange, more rustic looking. So I think I'm going to be doing that. Um, and then they had them in a red, uh, like a deep red. They were so beautiful. And one other color, I think a green or some color, so it was like a darker color. And all these other fall um, beautiful um, florals. And I did not see the um, cotton picks that they are supposed to be getting, but supposedly they are gonna be getting some cotton picks that are mixed in with like some pine cones and like these little, I don't know what you call them, but they're like plastic. It's like a mixture of pick um, with the cotton stems. You get two cotton stems on there. And I thought that was a good price. Um, but these are just beautiful in my little burlap bucket. Um, I'll arrange them a little bit better. But I thought for the price, because I was going to go and buy these other ones that um, one of my subscribers told me about, Dal. Um, hi. <laughs> she told me about um, Trending Tree. And they had some cream colored ones. And they were beautiful. And they were like under $5 per stem. And you did get... It was like a maybe six, five or six to the bunch. Um, and they were a lighter color than this, yes. But I feel, and I'm, I probably still will order those. But I liked these because they were a dollar. They had the burlap. They looked antiqued and aged, which is more my style. And I really loved them. And for a dollar, you can't go wrong. And I liked I like this type of flower better with like my, um, that was my dog, <laughs> like the aged um, 4th of July stuff. I just think it looks better. So I am so happy I found these. Um, like I said, they had a rust color, a red color, um, and one other color, and I can't remember. So I got all of the cream vanilla color that they had, and then um, I got these hydrangeas and I think I got four of these and they're the vanilla color look how beautiful they are with like the black centers or dark brown centers and then the burlap flower and then the regular vanilla one aren't those beautiful this I feel like I've hit the mecca because the plates and then these are I'm like, I'm done. I am so done. I I don't even need to shop anymore, but I know I'm going to. So I have four stems in here in this Target um, slotted olive bucket with the little um, copper handles. And I don't know why I didn't get the rust colored ones in the hydrangea and the sunflowers because if you really look at these sunflowers next to these sunflowers you're gonna see a huge difference now this this is a gorgeous pop of color of course but the like what do you think looks better <laughs> i think these do i think these are pretty but i'll get these ones this type in this color because i think this is just a little too bright for me um even if i put them outside i think it's just a little too bright so you guys tell me what you think of them. I want to hear what you have to say about them because I think they're gorgeous. And they had the whole wall done in these florals. And I thought, oh my God, they're beautiful. Last thing were these deep red hydrangeas. Look at, and I just put them in the Dollar Tree container and I think it looks really pretty in there. 
They kind of look like geraniums almost. Um, anyway, so these have the same thing, that dark red center with the burlap. They're beautiful. I only bought three because I wasn't sure about them, but I like this also with my um, 4th of July stuff better. So, yes, I am definitely going back and buying more. Probably going to be buying them out. No. <laughs> um, but I'll probably be getting, oh, several more of the red, the cream hydrangeas also, and then the rust colored um, sunflowers, and then the more cream if they have them, because I really love those cream. Those are going to go perfect for almost all, well, all through fall, spring, um, summer through fall. Okay, last thing, I'm going to show you what I did with um, some of my Dollar Tree pictures. I'm going to take you over here. Now, I don't think I like it. It's too busy. And I put three of my farmer's market um, pictures up here on the wall. I don't know if you could see it. Okay. On this, it's like a, a very thin wood and then um, a panel. And it has like two um, things at the very top to hang it with, which I didn't use. They're like gold. Um, but I had all the black framed ones and I did the cherry, the tomato, and then the raspberry grape or grape, I think, uh, jam in the middle. But I think with everything over here, it's too much, like way too much stuff. So I'm going to have to move it because, and now I may not even like those yellow. So no, I do. I do. Cause I have a lot of yellow accents with lemons and, honeycomb stuff that I'll be bringing out, but it's just not right there. So I'll be taking it down. But what I thought, guys, I want your opinion on, what do you think about me painting this wood panel here like in a cream, or white cream? So it is wood, and I don't know if you can tell that. Get up close. It's, it is wood, though. It's all wood. And I don't know if that would look better and put it somewhere else. I just don't have a lot of wall space in my kitchen. That's like really the only wall space. And then above my pantry, sorry, my, I have dishes uh, to do. See, above my pantry door. So, not sure if I, I don't like that. I'm going to have to switch it around a bit. I don't know. But there's another major change that I did. I will show you guys later in another video. I moved some furniture around and I really like it. So I want to share that with you. And that is it guys. You guys need to go to the Dollar Tree really quickly though, like in the next couple of days because they just got this fall um, floral in. And I don't think it's gonna last very long because this is like Hobby Lobby quality, you know, with the little burlap flowers that they inserted and so these I think are going back <laughs> and I'm getting more of the hydrangeas more of the sunflowers in multiple colors maybe some more reds I'm not sure because I almost feel like they look like geraniums and I could maybe possibly use them through Christmas I'm not sure but definitely through fall that's it guys that's all I have but I felt good with all these goodies and I finally found some lighter sunflowers I might see how they might look over in that picture, but after the summer. I want to use these for fall because the yellow, I do like the pops of yellow with the lemon and lemon um, or sunflower theme. So I think I want to keep that. But guys, I hope you have a wonderful day. I am tired. I'm probably going to eat something and go to bed. So <laughs> have a great one. I will talk to you later. And please, if you like this video, like and subscribe. Thanks, guys. Bye.